Ask Tom on Home Show. Jamon from Clemville, Texas, has a question about tile scratches. Yeah, specifically, Tom, there are these tiles that are in his bathroom. And it's I appreciate when people send in pictures. Sometimes we can really see what you're talking about. And if you look yeah. really closely, I know it's hard to see, there are these scratches on there. And that's what, that's what has him concerned. Jamon writes to us. He says, my 12 by 24 ceramic tiles are scratched and stained. They have a light matte finish. Is it a viable option to paint over the ceramic floor tile? And if so, what is the process or best product for doing this? And what's the longevity if I were to paint a bathroom floor? Well, you guess you could paint anything, but at a floor covering on a tile like that, the longevity would be as, as long as you don't walk on it, you're okay. Uh, but once you start walking on it, it's history. So you can make it last forever if you just close the door and not go in there. And I'm saying that in a lighthearted way. Uh, it's just your tiles are wearing out. It's time for new tile, new floor of some kind. Maybe even tile on top of it. Maybe uh, go with some of the new vinyls and do it on top of it. Maybe tear it out and, you know, call someone like a cutting edge tile removal, clean it all up, put a new tile floor in. But it, painting, I don't think, would be an option that I would even consider on a tile floor. Mm. It, in fact, we just put a new tile floor in our bathroom and we went ahead and bought an extra two boxes of tile yeah. because how many times do we get um, get questions from people who say, "Can I find, where can I find this tile or that tile? And we had such a great experience in our kitchen um, because the owner had bought extra tile for that floor. So we decided we're going to learn and do this for ourselves as well. Do you th is that advice that you would give anybody who's doing a tile floor? Yeah, I just want to add to that. Anytime, most tile manufacturers, anytime they have a good selling tile and they sell a lot of it, they tend to, to switch the tile designs every three to four years. They don't keep producing that tile for 10 years or 20 years. It just doesn't happen. And so you might find another manufacturer does something close, but it'll never match right. So you always store extra boxes somewhere. I've got tile in my garage. Some of it I probably need to get rid of because I've already gotten rid of the tile and I still have some in the garage, but you always save some for repair work. And even then, in this case, let's say he saved some, Charlie, uh, because this tile is so damaged and the floor is probably worn kind of evenly the way it mm. looks, and you put a brand new one that's never been walked on, it could stick out even worse. And even though it's the same tile because it's new and the other ones are worn and old. So All you right. just don't know. You have to put it down and kind of look at it first before you go through that work. Go click on that Ask Tom button at homeshoreradio.com if you got a question like that. And we can help you out just like that. Tom's happy to do it. He loves to help out. That's why he's been doing this for over 30 years on the radio. He's a home builder, has a degree in architecture, and a whole bunch of experience to share with you. And uh, you can find our videos posted every day at homeshowradio.com, of course, and our Facebook page, and, of course, the Home Show Radio YouTube channel.